All right, we'll go back for some more Link's giant adventure. And picking up some more upgrades in the last part. Got the nifty fire boomerang. So I can let that start doing some damage. Now I think I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna want to buy another piece of meat because I think I will need it for uh, level three. Yeah, level 3 should be pretty simple at this point. I'm way overpowered for this. Okay, let's step into level three. And this... This looks kind of weird because uh, look at the... Weird color. Tunic sprite here. You know, it's kind of whitish now. I'm not sure why I'm... A bit of a color change. Should not have the one way statue here because it makes it very annoying to try to figure this out. Okay, uh, I don't think I go right yet. I think that leads towards the end of the level. I don't have to worry about these spikes since uh, I have boots. That's a useless clue because uh, I've already gone through at least part of level four.
Okay, well, I'm getting the leader each time. I'm wiping up the whole room. And here, get Lens of Truth. It's actually kind of helpful for finding a lot of the secrets because... Uh, Sometimes you don't have any clues where, especially with the red candle, uh, which which little tree do you burn? This level's a lot easier when you have some better equipment, so... so... If you come here right away, you know, you'll probably be spamming arrows. Take some extra bombs. At this point, it's pretty much making your way back to the start. Kinda wish there was some wall masters. Could just use that as a quick shortcut.
just scooping up the extra loose chain that I'm dropping along the way. Spikes, huh? You just pretty much walk over these. there for a reason. This would be kind of hard to see. You you can kind of barely see the spikes. Unfortunately, the lens doesn't help you. You actually have to look pretty closely to see where to go. Or actually, you could um you may have to damage yourself with a bomb, boost yourself over the spikes. But not that I really care. I can just walk over this. Uh, no sweat. I think the actual starting point's right here. You can barely see the safe points. Uh, again, because the lens doesn't help you here. If you look very carefully, you can kind of see how the safe path goes, but... Um, maybe better to come here with at least a blue ring. And then just bomb yourself over the gap. At least in this case, I, I have boots, so I can just walk over this. You know, this whole room is meaningless. I have the wrong boss roars here. Double boss roars. Actually, even the room before, I think, was... Uh, um, like the, the Dongo boss roar, so it's just using every noise you can find. Yeah, so pretty trivial level. You know, we bring come back with some upgrades, make things a lot easier for yourself.
go to level three down. I might as well go to level four. Because that level is going to take a little while just because there's just so many rooms to go through. It's not really that difficult. Okay, so my level three out of the way. And I'll probably, well, next part I'll catch up level four and get me back up to par. And by then I'll probably have more money and probably uh, go get some more heart pieces or something. And then go from there. Alright, see you guys later.